Hi guys, my name is Jason Hub and I'm representing EcoFlow today. We are going to be demonstrating to you the installation of a porcelain pasadera urine diverting pedestal. The template is very similar to all the templates we send out with other pedestals. This one has a very unique difference. Generally, we'll be just focusing on cutting one hole for the chute. In this particular case, we also need to cut a secondary hole, which is going to be for the diverting holes. You will also receive a toilet seat attached to the pedestal. It has not been locked into place, so feel free to take this and move it away. Hook the metal clamp around one end of the solid holes. First I'm going to put my hand inside and find the attachment piece to the urine diverting hole. Then I'm going to take the hose with the metal clamp and connect it to the attachment piece. Push and twist to make sure that it properly connects. I'll then grab a short flathead screwdriver and tighten the clamp around the connection until it is secure. So now I have placed the rest of the hose down the small hole. Are our waste chute installed? I didn't screw down the brackets in this demonstration, but you would have already done so in step three using the template. Now we can lift the pedestal and place it into position over the brackets in the waste chute. With the brackets in place, you'd be coming straight down to ensure that that matches the brackets on the floor. install the seat on top of the pedestal, the two connection points there. They line up with the two points here. Once they fall into place, we can close it back down. The next part would just be a matter of taking the hose and connecting it to the absorption trench, which would be described in your instruction manual for your composting toilet. We have now completed our installation of a Pasadera. Thank you for watching today.